is what's going on now. I got my don't trade on us rifle. As I said, this is not clean. I shot you under rounds. But this is for sure it's gonna be even worse. So now the idea is to round the chamber. Okay. Mag check. Safety on. Okay. What I'm going to do now, dump this rifle. I'm trying to avoid to get mud dough into the barrel, okay? I don't want to create a situation that could be dangerous. So, I'm just putting it right now. Okay. Ah. Let's make it better. All the way. Line is set, ready, go! Okay. Now I am really into the mud, okay? It's kind of cold, by the way, just to let you know. We gotta do something that is realistic, under stress. First of all, I'm cold. Number two, the rifle, it's a mess. Number three, I'm gonna do some push-ups. So I remove this one, okay? Put it in a way that is safe. I'm gonna do 20 push-ups, let's just do 10. One in the mat. Now I need to see. Okay, now we go shoot. Okay, I can see nothing. That's part of the drill. Okay, I'm gonna look for the rifle. Look it up. Okay, I need to get some water to wash it up. Okay, now let's go straight to the target. We're gonna do drills to see this rifle shoot. Okay, we got some balloons there. I'm gonna just test now to run full cycle. Line is set, ready, go. Flat. Line is set, ready, go. Let's go for the red. Let's go for the green. Let's go for the blue. Yellow. Okay. Now, keep training. This is the rifle. Kind of a mess. We don't stop. Let's do a tactical reload. I'm in a low of a fight. Safety on. I want a chamber, check, change the magazine with a fresh one. So, magazine check, get a good bag, and okay, we got a fresh one inside. Kind of dusty, okay, kind of moldy. Guess what, let's see if it shoots. Okay. Okay. All right, more mud, let's go back into the mud. Now, I remember when I was a kid, you go to watch this war movie, they're always in the mud, and they crawl in the mud. Let's crawl in the mud with the Don't Tread On Us rifle. Okay, first of all, let's go flat. Line is set, ready, go! Now, we are in the mud, we gotta put more mud, okay? So look, mud everywhere. You see that? Now, there is a 200 yard shot. I have no gongs, but I'm gonna look at the rock. Okay, now I got to change. Good. Keep shooting. There we go. All right, guys. You know, the rifle is not something that you put on the wall as a museum piece. At least for me, it's a tool. Like once you got your, you know, whatever tool you have, you want to clean it up. And you shouldn't be afraid to use it, also in extreme situations. Okay, mud is part of the real world. Okay. You know, you're gonna be having a chance to fight where you want. Maybe sometimes it could be in your living room. Maybe sometimes could be in a city or in a town, hopefully not. 
maybe sometime could be in the mud. So guess what? The rifle performed great so far. And I'm gonna wash it up a little bit. By the way, ready to check. No ramp, no round, no round is in the chamber. So it's open. That's what I like also the lower metal polymer. Okay? One time plastic is your friend. I don't need to stress out too much. There we go. I'm back into the fight. All right. Okay, guys, today was the test. We tested the Don't Trade On Us rifle in the mud. This. Now I'm gonna get a wash, wash it up nicely, and then you go back to Lubin and treat it right, okay? I don't do this to abuse the rifle. I love this rifle. But I wanted to show the point. It's a tool. Don't be afraid to use it. And try to push the limits, of course. Don't do that, and then if something happens, hey, buddy, my rifle broke, you do this just in an emergency situation. But the point is that this rifle can shoot in the mud. Remember something, when you shoot in the mud, the only thing you should really be concerned, it's about that you don't want anything in the, in the front of the barrel, okay? So don't do that at home. If you do it, do it with some supervision, maybe just use your brain, okay? And if you blow it up because you put mud in your barrel, that's your problem, don't come back to me, okay? Anyway, that was great, and uh, go to freedomrifle.com. Don't dread us.